Hey guys, I want to shoot a quick video here for you for two reasons, okay? Every time I find something cool new, I like to shoot a new video. If I figure out how to do something, I'll put it out there. But uh, this is two things. Number one, I ran a campaign recently, uh, the end of January, and over the course of three days or four days or so, no, actually over the course of uh, five days, uh, I got about um, 400 and something opt-ins. And from then, I had a whole bunch of conversions to sales and upgrades and also into my primary business. So I'm pretty excited about the campaign that I ran. More on that later. In addition to that, I got this new cool software that I found for creating this video here that I'm doing for you right now. Now, in the past, I've always done my um, uh, my videos with uh, with Movie Maker. And uh, if you see here, Movie Maker is in Windows, um, where I can just this is my Movie Maker, and I can click right here for webcam. And that will go ahead and uh, shoot a video of me. And I don't like to do it too often because I usually have a bad face day. But um, this will shoot from the webcam. So, so that's pretty cool. So let's just X out of that. Um, or you can go into YouTube. And uh, let's go to YouTube here, as I am. And when you're in, see, just to show you, it's YouTube. And what you do here is you click on Upload. And then it gives you the option. Now, if I click on webcam, it's going to capture, um, again, from my webcam, integrated webcam, um, from your from your PC. And it will go ahead and use your microphone, however you set it up, and it can do that. And then also, if you wanted, you could do Google Hangouts on air, and it will go ahead and use, um, uh, you could do screen sharing uh, on that. Actually, one of, the, one of my favorite ones for doing screen sharing, let me screen sharing, screen sharing. Is, a, is another free software here called Cam Studio. Uh, I'm just bringing it up here. Here it goes. And Cam Studio is pretty cool because it allows you to go ahead and create also from your webcam or from uh, screen sharing. And that's how I do most of my videos where I'm showing you how to you know, do various things. So that's pretty cool too. And that's also free. Cam Studio, not to be confused with Camtasia, which I believe is the purchased version of this, and it's excellent. Cam Studio is a little bit more limited, but really it does everything I needed, and you can record unlimited videos with it. But the one I'm using right now is, um, uh, let me just go ahead and bring it up, is called Screencast, here it is, Screencast Omatic, right there, and I'll put the link also below. Um, screencast omatic screencast dash o dash matic dot com and they're all letters there's no numbers in there um, and then you can just go ahead and start recording as you can see here or you have the ability to and I think that's what I'm doing on this one here is I downloaded the app and it brings you over to CNET you just have to be careful because CNET tries to upsell you and install a whole bunch of new software on your machine so please be careful Anytime you install from CNET.com, and you always want to do advanced, and you might think to yourself, well, I'm just a newbie. I can't do advanced. No, please, do advanced, and I'll tell you why. You click on advanced, it does a simple thing of allowing you to, um, uh, to change the install options, okay? It's no big deal, and the main thing that it always wants to do is download Google Chrome, which I already have, and change my, my, uh, my homepage, which I don't want to change that, and the last thing that it tries to do is it tries to install all these, you know, uh, toolbar things going across your thing, answer.com or whatever. So I always go into advanced. But anyway, so those are the multiple things. But this video I'm creating right here is from this software here, Screencast Omatic. Now, it's free. The only thing with the free version is that with the free version, it's going to put in a watermark down below, I believe in the bottom left of your video. Uh, with the website, screencastomatic.com, um, like a little banner. I don't believe it's clickable, but it just puts that on there, which is cool. And you're limited to a 15-minute video, and there's some other things that are missing from it. And really, if you wanted to, you can go ahead and take multiple 15-minute videos and put them all together with the movie maker that I just showed you. But um, if you want, you can upgrade to the pro version, which is what I did. And, you know, I'm able to update to the pro version because of the enormous amounts of money 
that I'm making, I was able to afford the pro version. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to afford it. Let me tell you how much it costs. It's $15 for the year. That's all it is. $15 for the year. There's no affiliate link. I don't think there could be because there's no money to go around at a $15 uh, uh, price range. But it's pretty cool because it's, um, uh, it's, it's, I mean, to me, that's considered free. And I think it's every year you'll have a $15 fee, and, and you know, which hopefully all of you can afford, even without having to reinvest your profits that you've made within your Empower business or whatever primary business that you're running. So anyway, I wanted to share that. And the cool thing about this is that, number one, I'm able to share my screen, and I could put in the size of the screen I want to share. And right now, I'm just doing a small window. And in addition to that, um, it puts a video of you at the bottom right of the uh, screen here. Even the free version does that, which is pretty cool. So, uh, so I do like it. I've been looking for software like this for the longest time. But right now, I'm going to go ahead and stop this video. And the, the steps that I'm going to do, once I stop this video, the Screencast-O-Matic is going to bring up, it's going to go back to its website. I'm going to be able to name this video. I can't show you now, obviously, because once I hit stop, the video is going to stop recording. But it's going to, uh, you can go ahead and test it out yourself. It's going to ask me to name the video. And it's going to ask you where I want to publish it. I can publish it directly to YouTube or to various other places. But I'm going to save it directly to my PC, to my laptop. So I'll give it a file name, and then I'll say um, save to file, and then it asks me what format I want it in. I'll put it into MP4 format, which is friendly all over the multiple platforms, and then I could go ahead and do myself, upload it to YouTube or upload it wherever I want to load it to. So I do want to share that with you. I hope that helps, um, and we'll see you on the next video.